Welcome to our answer for managing utility demand charges. The E27 series of products works with the appliances you have in your home. We just add to what you already have and potentially help you to pay less money. Right now, you're probably paying between 13 and 25 cents per kilowatt hour for your electricity, but you can choose to change to the E27 plan and only pay 4.8 cents for the same electricity. That would mean a much lower bill each month. However, if you change to the E27 plan, you would pay your electric utility company in two ways. First, you pay each month for the amount of electricity that you use during each day, your kilowatt hours or KWH. But then you also pay them a demand charge that's based on your peak rate of usage measured in kilowatts or KW during what they define as peak hours. The peak hours in the summer are from 1 p.m. to 8 p.m. Nicely, the demand charges do not apply on the weekends or holidays. Here's a chart to help explain the monthly demand charges. Every weekday in a billing month during those peak hours, your rate of usage is averaged over 30 minute periods. If your average peak rate did not exceed one kilowatt, then you would be billed a $9 demand charge for that month. If it was up to two kilowatts, then your demand charge for that month would be $18. And if it was up to three kilowatts, then your charge would be $28 and so on. Each one kilowatt step up in averaged peak demand means you pay a higher demand charge for that month, even if that peak demand occurred just once in the month. But that's why we made our E27 series of products to help automatically keep this all under control. Here's what some of your large loads can draw. If a few of these happen to come on during the peak hours of any summer weekday, you could be hit with a demand charge of $100 or more. The E27 series of products simply adds a smart load controller that helps manage your peak demand levels. And we also offer a solar system and a battery storage system. The end result is that you get to keep your current comfort and lifestyle, you get a much lower cost of electricity, and you can avoid costly demand charges. On weekdays after 1 p.m. and up until 8 p.m., the demand controller will continually monitor from four up to eight of your high power appliances. If your demand rate is getting too close to an upper limit that you have prearranged with your installer, that's when the demand controller takes action and temporarily turns off one or more of these heavy appliances to keep you from going over your demand limit and keep you from hitting those higher charges. We first would disconnect the electric water heater, then would be any pool equipment. Third, might be one of your air conditioners, and it could go further, temporarily turning off any golf cart charging or limiting the laundry for a few hours. As people turn things off in the house, these heavy loads will be allowed to come back on. And after 8 p.m. on weekdays, once again, you can use any of your appliances as you like. And you can add a solar system. This allows you to reduce the amount of electricity you need to buy from the utility. Plus, it adds another way to keep away from high demand charges. We would typically install an 18 module solar array on your roof and a solar inverter near your existing electrical breaker panel. During each day, the solar array converts free sunlight into DC electricity and the inverter converts that into common household AC power. That not only means you pay less for energy that month, but also keeps you further away from hitting high demand charges from 1 p.m. to around 4. You can add our battery storage option that works with the solar inverter. It gets its charge from the solar array, but can also be charged up from the utility grid, so it's always full by the afternoon. Then, when the solar array output goes down with the sun every evening, your system automatically starts drawing from the battery to once again help run your house plus keep you away from hitting high demand levels until the peak hours are over at 8 p.m. that night. And with our battery option, you have power even if the utility goes down. If there's an outage, other houses will lose power, and even other solar-powered homes will stop working too. But with our battery solution acting as an automatic backup, you can operate some selected critical loads during the day and at night, day after day. We put the circuits for some selected critical loads into a new critical load subpanel 
Critical loads like your refrigerator, so you don't lose any food. Your garage door opener, so you can get your cars in and out and keep things safe. Lights in your living and bedrooms for comfort and security. And TVs, so you can stay informed. Plus, power to some wall outlets, so you can charge your phones and other small appliances. Even if the outage goes on for days, the solar array will recharge the battery. So you get to keep running your critical loads day after day until the utility power is restored.